hello today I would like to show you something interesting that I recently came across this is first of all this is not a genuine relay so please ignore that this is a fake one that came from China this is not a genuine so don't leak in the, in the company with the problem this is the relay that was used on the 24 volt system and it was used for switching a charging circuitry for a lead acid battery that was a two 12 volt batteries in series so it was giving a nominal voltage that this relay was low as you can see we are capable of switching of 10 amps and 28 volt DC so exactly that what we are going to use and it was after a charging controller and it was set on about 8 amp so it was also below the stated of 10 amp current that this device was allowed to operate just from the from the old labels and as you can see we have a fire and I'm unable to to trace what happened does it does it catch like some kind of arc or does the the contacts were just uh, completely fake and the 8 amp was able to to melt them that's how it looks like maybe someone have a similar problem I'm going to take it apart so if you know if that was overcurrent or it was a arc that was created that melt that that way please leave a message in the comment of course I I had to replace everything starting from the the base which is melted lucky it looks like it was made from the fire fireproof material so it just melted and it didn't catch a live fire as you can see everything was melt and the contacts stood out from the base you can see them outside the casing don't look at that this is not a genuine this is a china fake relay and I would never expect to to have any problem I would be scared if I'm going to use that on the main AC voltage then I would buy a genuine but uh, 20 24 volt sounds safe so I would never expect something like that to happen let's try to to grab a tool and open this uh, let me see do I have do I have uh, okay give me a second okay I've got it let's try to open this okay the case is stuck give me a flat screwdriver and let's see can we pop this out it's not happy
Okay. So that was the the case, and this is the internal parts. There's the contacts that was hot enough to It looks like that one created some kind of a problem because I can see the discoloration. Maybe that was an arc. If you if you know what happened, please share that information with me. So yes, that's how it looks like. So, I do not recommend them, because as you can see, it was, I'm 100% sure that it was operating inside the, the specified current and the voltage, it was about 8 amp, because that was preset on the charging circuitry, so it was, I'm 100% sure it didn't overcurrent that and I put a, a new replacement and I was touching and it didn't didn't go warm so that's not an overcurrent and also we didn't we didn't overshoot the the allowed voltage so yes that's how it looks like this is a China relay that catch a fire so thank you very much for watching, see you next time and bye bye.